And so we have a new toy right here. This is the all new Fujifilm XS20 and the Fujinon XF 8mm f3.5. Let's talk about it. And so before anything else, I would like to officially welcome you to my channel. Thank you for making it past the intro. If you are into cameras, gadgets, technologies, all that good stuff, please do subscribe and hit that bell if you haven't yet. In that case, you won't miss out on anything from this channel. By the way, a huge shout out to Fujifilm Philippines for sending these over and for making this video possible. Having that out of the way, let's talk about the 7 reasons why this could be your next vlogging camera. Reason number 1. The X-S20 is very compact and portable. Even with the Fujinon 8mm lens, it still is incredibly small for a setup. And for me, that's very ideal considering that this is meant for handheld vlogging. So when you are out and about doing contents, this won't be shouting or anything. You know what I'm saying? Plus the fact that 8mm, 12mm full frame equivalent is absolutely wide enough. Like for real. Hence, you can hold it even while your arm is folded and much more relaxed. But obviously, you can stretch out your arm to show more of your surroundings and whatnot. Nonetheless, if this ain't an ideal vlogging setup for you, I don't know what is. Reason number two, the XS20 has mic input and monitor output. Yes, you heard it right, meaning you can directly connect your audio equipment to the camera. No need for in-between recorders or anything. So when you vlog, you can record decent audio right out of the box. Like literally, plug and play. Not only that, you can also connect your headphones to monitor your audio even while recording. This is a good thing whenever you want to make sure that you are recording your audio properly. Good job, Fujifilm. Reason number 3. The X-S20 has fully articulating screen, which is incredibly useful for both photos and videos. To be honest, I think this should be like a standard feature of cameras moving forward. Especially now that vlogging is life, people. Vlogging is life. At least in my opinion. Reason number 4. The X-S20 has a reliable in-body image stabilization. So if you are going to really vlog with it, you don't need extra gimbal or whatsoever. With the built-in stabilizer, you can already record decent quality vlog content with this camera. How amazing is that? Reason number 5. The X-S20 has an amazing autofocusing performance. Like for real. As a matter of fact, the best autofocusing Fujifilm camera that I've tried so far is the X-T5. And guess what? The very same system has the X-S20 as well. So you can expect no less as far as autofocus is concerned. It has both eye and face tracking, thus it follows the subject very well. And at this day and age, people pay premium for cameras with great autofocusing performance. Would you agree? Reason number 6. The X-S20 has improved battery capacity. I don't want to give you numbers just like many YouTubers do, but instead, let me give you a practical illustration. With my other crop sensor cameras, I shoot my A-roll and B-roll using two full batteries. But with the X-S20, I shoot both in just one. Can you believe that? Which for me is very convenient as I don't want to lose momentum while working only because the battery could not keep up. You know what I'm saying? So props again to Fujifilm for making such a big leap on this department. Finally, reason number 7. The X-S20 is a 10-bit camera. I don't want to sound too technical on this, but having a 10-bit feature simply means it has more color information even when you shoot in a log profile. And shooting in log is very beneficial especially if you are into color grading. Like if you are doing cinematic contents, color grading is almost like a requirement in order to achieve that cinematic look. Like for real. I can go on and on and on with the features of this camera. Like it has vlog mode, webcam functionality, etc. But I just thought of sharing 7 most important things I look for in a vlogging camera. And oh by the way, if I haven't mentioned, the price of the Fujifilm X-S20 is... You let me know in the comment section if that's affordable for you or not. In any case, ladies and gentlemen, as for conclusion, with all the features of the Fujifilm X-S20, I'd say if given the chance, I would definitely want to have one of these in my bag. Because if there's such a perfect vlogging camera, you are looking at it 
right now. And there you go, folks. I am sure I wasn't able to cover everything. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section or we can connect on Instagram or on Facebook. As I end, if you're getting value from this video, please do like and subscribe for more not super technical, but rather practical approach to gadgets and technologies. Until then, thank you for watching.